Hello, everybody, and welcome back. I know it's been way too long to another episode of Jurassic World Live. And this is my first ever episode recording in a new office. I thought I was going to be without internet for another three weeks. Uh, but it's, you, would you believe we basically got the guy in the other day and he was like, hey, here you go. Well done. And he put some sort of date in my head. And I was like, oh, well, that's three weeks away. And then I was like, you know what? Let's just try to turn on the internet. And would you believe it works? <laughs> so I, I was deliberately not allowing myself to use the internet accidentally. Anyway, we're here. Biggest differences is it's a bigger space. I'll just quickly go over the updates because uh, I have been religiously trying to play Jurassic World Alive. You'll also notice I am moving around a bit more, which might not work with the setup. I mean, oh, teething issues. If you go back to when I first moved to Japan, yeah, it, the place looked a lot different. And I'm sure this, this place will change too. Uh, but I'm able to stand up. I have a desk that I can actually customize. It's not just a, a desk desk. Like, that's it. That's all it does. This thing moves up and down. I can sit. I can stand. I feel way more comfortable. Uh, only thing is, well, one thing I did bring over is that this place also doesn't have AC in this room. Oh, great. <laughs> there has been so many things that have updated in Jurassic World Alive um, that I want to cover. Hopefully I'm putting up footage of me darting uh, the Dracovinator. I think I've darted it twice more. Uh, the first time I darted it, didn't go over too well. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> or it, well, it did, but I didn't get as many uh, direct hits as I did the first time. And then the second time I dodged it, did did very good. Good things. Uh, but they've also added a new rarity. And this new rarity, I I mean, I've been told about it. it it's in the game now. There's an Isla Nublar event, so we will unlock it this episode. Uh, there's also a new dinosaur, the um, a, a Styracosaurus Lux which I forgot to do the Isla event for, so don't have that. <laughs> but I did dart it, and I got a really high score on it. Uh, hopefully I'll show you guys. So, hold on. Can I, can I bring this up? Oh, God. How, who, how are we going to do this? There is Toro from Camp Cretaceous. Interesting. We're starting to see, you know, we had Blue, Beta, and we're getting all these uh, dinosaurs. I didn't think Toro was going to be one we get, but here we are. Bumpy, I guess, you know. This is it. I was only a couple off as well. Styracosaurus looks, again... It's a fierce resilient. Now that's so weird um, that those two, because they're usually the counters for each other, you know. But whatever, or at least re actually resilient is. Good. You know what I mean? To be all attack and then all defense doesn't really make sense. Uh, but it's a unique because of course it's a unique. Now that's what Lydia is doing now. They're like, you know what? Uniques are the way forward. They're the ones you can get extra stuff for. But the controversial thing um, is. Well, it's not really controversial. Also, can we just admire and look at these supply pads? Like, the last one actually had the the best Jurassic Park logo that you could have. And that was the yellow Jurassic Park. That's my favorite. But this one, it has Barbasol can. They've went completely out for this. They've made giant Jurassic Park gates. Now, these gates, the Jurassic World gates, are usually at the theme parks. Uh, you can spin the thing, or at least in California and Florida, I think. I thought about Japan, actually. I never played this in Japan. I'm, I'm up. If you guys want to see a video playing Jurassic World Live in Islands of Adventure, I'll, I'll, I'll do that. I'll, I'll make that content for you. <laughs> I don't know why I haven't thought about that. I'm in a country now where I could literally just get on a train and go to Universal Studios. That's brilliant. So this is bringing me into another thing that I want to add um, to the channel. And that is IRL streaming where what we do is we go out and we just dart stuff. Because the three new dinosaurs, Diplos, Diabloceratops, Toro, and I can't remember what the other one is. Um, they are a new rarity that is... It, it doesn't abide by the rules of normal rarity. So you'd have common, rare, um, epic, legendary, unique, apex. And up to a point, it made sense. Then it got convoluted. And now it's got even more convoluted, uh, if you want to call it for a lack of a better name. It doesn't abide by anything. It's literally, depending on what uh, battle you put it in, it will be automatically set to a certain level, the Dracovinator. Yes, so I've darted it uh, three times now. I'm going to say, is it level 23? Maybe. Uh, I don't know. Also, of course, the new dinosaurs, they've added the incubators, which are a fortune and definitely should buy. And actually, I haven't. I was very tempted for the poop phone call emote. And maybe I will. I don't know. I can't help myself. It's, it's like Jurassic Park 3. Gotta, gotta do it. Um, so we got level 24. Okay, so it's not, it's free. It's completely free. I'm not going to complain about that. But 
I was saving this because this is my new team. Look at it. Look how amazing that team looks. Um, you may realize Rexy, the dinosaur I spent almost $3,000 on, is no longer there. That, that, that really hurt me to do that. <laughs> but uh, I got rid of Rexy and I brought... Oh my god, I, I know, I know. You're looking at it. I'm looking at it as well. I don't, I don't want to look at it. I'll get as far away from it as possible. But no, Dio's there. Or Dilo, not Dio, because that's the Raj. But I have seen that level 30 with max uh, stats and stuff. So, I mean, I'm, I kind of want to get it to uh, the next level to give it that 10% extra attack. And to be honest, I'm almost I'm almost in New Blush Shores. I mean, we'll get to that in a second. Almost there. And I think just an extra 10% would really help push it over the edge. Um, I feel like nowadays, you could probably just have a full team of uniques, really. Because you get 10% health, 10% attack, an extra boost, two extra speed. Which is probably way better and tips it over the edge of Apex. So Apex are like lower than unique. But they... Oh. I need a rant video. I need a rant video just to talk about how messy this is. But finally, we will level this thing up to, oh yes, it has hurt me. Every time I come up against the Geminidas, they're always level 30. Um, but now finally mine could be level 30. And I can, if I want to, uh, make it 9,000 health. Actually, yeah, sh sod it, yeah, let's go. There we go, 9,000, finally. I've seen some that are 10, uh, 11,000 possibly. Or oh, I think that was something else. It's probably unique that was that. Um, I'm really just trying to get to my scorpions. Um, and as far as uh, incubators and sanks go, sorry, sanctuaries, I'm just giving it all the frogs. I feel like we're going to get a hybrid sometime that's going to use the frogs and it'll be really good. And I'm so hesitant to spend coin and anything else on other things because I just, look, there it is. Staring me in the face. The only things I really want here is the Ceratosaurus, possibly the Tyrannometrodon. <laughs> Okay, no. No, I'm not buying it. I'm sorry, what was that? That's not the right sound effect, is it? What are you doing? What are you doing? How, I mean, I guess it's probably copyright, isn't it? The Nokia sound effect. The do -do 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 -do. Sorry, okay, fair enough. It's not the same. It's like when Jurassic World Evolution put in the Ford Explorers. Or, you know, the Ford, they were supposed to be Ford Explorers, but they weren't Ford Explorers because they would get sued. So, it's a shame. But yes, sorry, this was the thing that's everywhere now. This dip, Diplado, whatever, the Diablo Ceratops. The only reason I know about this is because, or this dinosaur, is because of the Isle, actually. The Isle had it for a long time, uh, back in 20... 16, 15? God knows. Um, but there is so many ways to, like, buy it. There's that. There's the 99 pound. There's the 49 pound. There's the 24, 99. Any type you want, you can get. Um, and then you've got all these other ones. But there is something that you might want to purchase, which is the 30th anniversary scent. If you're just a collector of scents and you just like to have the full collection, go for it. Um, it's, it's prizes aren't too great, if I'm going to be honest. Um, there's T-Rex, there's, uh, Beta, I think, is in there. I don't know if you can actually see what's in it without buying it. No, you can't. Uh, you know what? I will buy another one, just because. We'll do it. And what I'd like to do with the IRL streams is we're getting a bike, have the camera. I'd love to hook up the phone so it's on the stream rather than, you know, in the, um, the camera. But I think that might be a bit too, <laughs> a bit too above my grade. Uh, but, you know, we'll, we'll get there. Just like this place, we will eventually have it looking really cool. Although you might think it looks really good now, so hey, there we go. Uh, so the Isla event, here it is. Um, I think all you need to do is win five battles. Um, so, and also there's the, um, the, the pass is going to change soon, and that's the only thing that if I buy something, I'll buy uh, is the pass. So, do we have anything that heals? Yes, we do. We have two major ones. We have Indian Emmys, which I've also put in my team. I didn't want to, but on my team. Uh, Rexy heals. Um, the, I think, Ceratosaurus might heal. Mm, intimidate. Maybe, yeah, well, that's cleansing. And of course, the frogs. If you've got like a level 30 frogs, that'd be really good. Um, I don't know if the compies heal. Maybe on a swap in. Yes. Okay. Okay. So it's their swap in allows them. Okie dokie. But I think. I don't know. I think Rexy's got this. Uh, add team. Yeah, whatever. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, new blah shores. I am. I think I'm on 5,900 cups, so pretty damn close. Uh, also, the Diablo Ceratops is another dinosaur that you can put into your tracker. Um, now, you can't put it into the tracker normally, which I think is a really big shame, because that's something that I think Ludia should just allow us to do. 
the fact that they haven't, you know, they've had a whole big update, it may be a case of they didn't foresee that, so they didn't put the fix into this, you know, most recent update, but they might do in the next one. Hopefully they don't, though. <laughs> Hopefully. We'll see. Anyway, uh, and we'd, yeah, there you go. Not even, not even a single. Needed that priority for the Raptor, and I knew Rexy would give me that. So, first battle, if you've got a Rexy, and it's a high enough level to instant hit, uh, well, the Raptor's not really the issue here. There you go. So, Diablo Ceratops, new creature discovered, resilient. So, actually, now that I've discovered it, can I put it in my tracker? So, I've still got that guy in there. But I think we, there's a weird glitch. In, oh! <gasps> oh, okay. So maybe you need to unlock it to put it into your tracker. The fact that it even shows up there is really cool. Um, oh, you know, maybe maybe this is something that you can just have. Like, oh, okay. Anyway, <laughs> I think it might be, actually. It's something you can just uh, put into your team once you've unlocked it. The fact is... Finding Dracovenator was a pain. So, you know, that's the issue. So what we got here, we got things that can all be one shot and nothing's faster than Rexy. You know what? We're just going to put in one Rexy. We've got this thing unlocked. I'm so annoyed at myself that it didn't unlock this Styracosaurus Lux. Um, so Diablo Ceratops is the, is I think maybe the only, if it's not the only, it's Taurus or, or sorry, what's it called? Toro is the only. Uh, so Diab <laughs> making no sense of me. So Diablo Ceratops, you can dart out in the wild. Toro, you can't at the moment. Anyway, I think it's only incubators that you can get it. Uh, we'll just quickly do this. I realize now it doesn't matter how much damage you do, I think you always get the same amount of health back. Um, even if... Let's have a look. Is it? No, maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> anyway, we're going to get a little bit more health from this. The Tony Calagrius. So not only have, you, have, I, have I been playing Jurassic World Alive all the time, I've also been playing Jurassic World the game. Um, but the, the thing is, because I had no internet when we moved into this place, Jurassic World the game, for some reason, every day requires a 600 megabyte download. So every day I've had to go to Starbucks or somewhere where I've had free internet to download it. It's been great! Um, I think there might be something in uh, Just All the Game at the moment. I think it's a Struthia Mimus that I need to I need to get. Um, at the team, yeah, sure. I th Honestly, I think Rexy's got this down. The only thing that might stop um, me just completely um, steamrolling this entire event is bosses. Um, I'm trying to think. Do we have a healer on our team? Rexy can't heal everyone. It can heal itself. Indonemis can heal itself. Uh, but if we had something that could do a passive, the frogs would be good, actually. Because the frogs... Oh, oh, I think we've done it. I think we've done extra 50% attack. Should be enough. Did I take all the speed off Rexy? Maybe. Maybe Rexy's not too fast. I, I mean, you never really need to speed up Rexy, right? Because you've got that priority. And then... Oh, no! <laughs> it didn't recover any health. Next to... Got like 2,000. Easy piece. But not, not that. No. Still, nothing changed, but that's good. That is round three, I think, or two. Wow, there's three already. Uh, so I don't even know what this is called, this type of creature. Um, like, at this point, we're going to run out of names. <laughs> it's like, common, rare, epic, legendary, unique, apex, alpha. <laughs> what are we going to go, beta? <laughs> it's going to be absolute madness. Right. Hurtadosaurus. Um, at this rate, I'm kind of tempted just to go for... Oh, oh, okay. Getting the counter off. Right. That's great, because that means Purosaurus is dead. I was, I was kind of worried. Oh, yeah. Okay, no need to be worried. I was worried that it would go for his cloak and then do a massive, uh, like, chunk to me. Maybe even kill me. Um, defensive swapping. Look at that, there's Scorpion. Do you remember when Captain Cretaceous was a thing? Do you remember that when it, they introduced Scorpius Rex? Oh, I can't believe it's almost a year. Or at least, I think in America, it's definitely been a year since uh, Jurassic World Dominion came out. For me, I think I watched it. I mean, in Japan, it came out in like September or October. Something ridiculous. I, I had to wait so, such a friggin' long time for it. Uh, Smilodon. Oh, come on, the health. There it is. There it is. Full health. Beautiful. And that's it. I'm better than round two. Round three. I've got me health back. And then... 
I mean, I may as well. Was I always faster? I think I must have been faster. That's that's why I went for the dominant role, wasn't it? Because if I didn't, he might have his cloak priority. So there we go. I've actually gained health. This is great. I think they've deliberately made this easy so we can unlock it. And wow, they, they really did that, huh? They really made it. 10 off. <laughs> Just in case. Okay, so what's the study? I think all of... It gets better and better. Like 30, 30, 60, 60, 140. So it must be enough to get it to a certain level then. We can do that. We can complete the entire Diablo Zerodops event. Um, oh, these ones are a little bit tougher. Uh, and then Emmys would be good against this. Should we use Enden Emmys? No. <laughs> I mean, I'll have it just in case. Just in case. But I'm not seeing anything that can heal everybody. There's no, um, no deer hybrid thing. Oh, I'm going to have to really think about it because there will be a boss. I think every event has had a boss. So we need to be a bit careful here. Uh, oof, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm going to go for Dominant Roar because I I don't think anything's faster than me. The Deodon thing isn't. This thing definitely isn't. And I don't think Agrocanthosaurus will be faster than Rexy. Um, so the Minor Precise Counter. That's all right. Um, so yeah, we, we, we are alive again, finally. I can get around to a few things that I've promised uh, my community that I would get around to doing. That is reacting to the toy collections on Discord for a start. Um, <laughs> like everything happened at the, at the wrong time. It was brilliant. Um, but yeah, oh, I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited to, to be here and to... I don't know. Got a lot of cool things planned. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying all the uh, Path of Titans things I've been doing. Uh, the premiering. It's always good to sort of watch it with you guys. Oh god. I was hoping that I would kill it in one. Um, you know what? Right, so I'm only going to do 500 damage, right? But I did 7,000. You only did 500 health, but I did 7,000. So really, I should only get about 100 health. But because it, if, he's, if he dies, it doesn't matter. You just get 2,000. Uh, I don't know if that's, you know, they, they've deliberately done that or if it's kind of broken. But yeah, it's weird that if you, you know, even if it's one health and you did a massive amount of damage, you get all of that back, even though you technically only did one damage. Um, and there it is, Diablo Ceratops. What even is it? God knows. Should we unlock it? Let's unlock it. Let's get it done. Yeah. So it's an Omega. That's right. Oh, damn. That is some ginormous horns. You know what? I'm a really big fan of this model. I love it. I love the way it looks. Um, I don't know. I, I think it's because I haven't... Ooh, wait, what? Evolved to claim. Hold up. Oh. oh. <laughs> it broke the game. <laughs> also, splash screen. Splash screen looks amazing. I love it. They really went all out for this 30th anniversary. And... I, I can't say anything about this, but the whole time I've done this on YouTube, I have only spoken to Universal once, and that was at an event. However, I'm not going to say anything because I can't. Um, I haven't signed an NDA or anything yet, but Universal finally got in touch with me. It took them for the Jurassic World franchise to be over, but they finally got in touch. So I just want to say... Thank you. Thank you, Universal. Finally. <laughs> it's above. So technically, it is above. But I, I just want to check out this. So 35% armor. Resilient. I mean, wait a damn second. Evolve. Oh. Wait, it's level one? Oh. Oh. So unlocks at level 11. Level 21. Unlocks at level 6. Unlocks at level 16. 100%. Can we get rid of stun? Can we just get rid of stun? Ludia, please. There is no need for stun to be a thing now. If anything ever gets stunned, it feels bad. If you're the one who got stunned, you, you rage because it's like, come on, I had like three, five, ten percent chance to get stunned. And then if you stun somebody, it's like, ah. well, he, it's just like it can win you the game if you, if you get lucky stunned. Swap prevention is good. Rend damage over time and vulnerability meh. Uh, map all times. This creature is active on the map throughout the 24-hour cycle. Ooh. Now, Dracovenator is only during the day, which is why we could see it on the map right now. I think he's... Which way is he? He's somewhere. There it is. Right, so we're not going to look at Diablo anymore, but we will keep on doing the battle of it. Oh, hey, hold on. 
5,990. So we'll definitely do one more battle. I mean, now that I've got like an extra level and a boost on my Germanitis, I mean, things are looking better. Okay, so we got Panther. Panther is uh, is an interesting one. Yeah, there's no group healers. No group healers. I kind of want to put... You know, I kind of want to level up the frog, but at the same time, I'm wary of it. Maybe I only need it at a certain level, and I don't want to level it up too much before, you know, I'll end up with a situation like Rexy, where I don't have it in my team. However, it's still very useful when it comes to, you know, battles like this. So we will go for... Should we go for... You know what? If I can kill Panther instantly, I'll be happy. So we'll just get my speed up, get my attack up, do a massive hit. Um, hopefully Panther comes out next. It does? Okay, right. So it has a nullification as it's normal. Does it have a priority? Evasive hunt. 100% um, chance to dodge. Oh, you bugger you. Oh, it didn't do it. Oh. <laughs> yes. Okay, that became really easy. So Spiders of Suits just next. Uh, and we got nothing to worry about. That's it. Done. Done. How much is it that you, you, you pay like 99, basically 100 quid for Diablo? And how much do you get for that? It doesn't seem like much. It's a 30th level one. No, that's a lot. It's like a common, the amount of DNA you need for it. Oh, Dracovinator. Okay. Okay. Can Rexy still carry me? We've got a flock here. We've got Dracovenator as well, which I've never really faced. Um, Rexy goes out first. We've got the Dodo thing. We need to save our roar for it. There it is. A referantum without the frill, basically. Frustrating impact. Okay. The f oh, dear. I'm worried that it could... Oh, 4,000. Um, it does have a dodge. Okay. Does it have anything if I switch out? Swap in distraction. Okay, I'm going to swap. It might swap. Okay, it didn't. Um, I'm assuming it's going to be immune to stun. Everything's immune to... Oh, it's a honey. What's the point? Just... The thing is, with Indian Emmys, because it has that stun... Oh, right. Okay. Do you have anything that goes through precise? You do. Oh, no. The cloaking rampage alert. Right. That cloaks yourself, though. Okay. So, we'll just go with this. Um, yeah. If it didn't have... It didn't do that stun, it would be able to swap in for free. I thought it swapped in with a cloak or some sort of dodge ability, but apparently not. Um, right, Cunning Rampage. That's okay, as long as it doesn't go through. I do have armor. It doesn't go through. Perfect. Um, does the Dodo lock you in? I don't I don't think Dodo locks you in. Um, we might as well just, you know, we're going... Ooh. Ooh, okay. I think Dodo might be coming in now. Is the bot being clever? It might be. Because I would have got so much health from that. But now that, you know, I can't kill the thing outright if it's the dodo. It's the dodo! Of course it's the dodo. Right, well, we killed one. Okay, so we can get some health. Now, can I swap out without a problem? Yes, I can. And I, oh, I'd swap into Rexy, though. Okay, okay, we'll do we'll do a little bit of damage. Hopefully it doesn't go for its, um, Healy boy. It does. But it didn't have enough to get... Oh, no, it does. <laughs> I thought it needed to be like a comp, you know, to be down, but uh, I guess not. Um, berserk. That's only 3,000 damage. Okay. I just want to save Rexy. I just want to save Rexy. Uh, Indian enemies, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with losing a little bit. Oh, okay. How much? Right, 612. But I do get some extra attack to 1,200. If I do my Healy, you know, devour, I... Oh, it's got two there! You little bugger you! I didn't realize I didn't kill it. You know what? You know what? We're gonna get out. We're gonna get out. If I if I can lose one, and I should probably always do that, just put in something that I'm willing to lose. That's the big brain play that I didn't do. Uh, Rexy will just get hit by something. Oh! Wait, what? Uh oh <laughs> Okay. Oh, wait, the counter! I forgot Rexy has this now. Um, okay, a swap. Dracovinator comes in. It's going to reduce my attack. Oh, reduce crit? Oh, no, reduce attack. But, I've, of course, I've got some attack, at least. Right, some damage. Um, he's probably going to go for his evasive. Oh, no, tough group cunning. Okay, I think he's dead. 
Yes, is that okay? Look at Rexy go! Damn! Oh, that's good. Extra more attack. Boom! Kills it. Good. Need it for Rexy. Need it for Rexy! Right, this thing. Uh, a bit worried about. What do you do? You have your rampages. Um, Rexy does have a lot of attack, though. Oh, reduce the speed. Oh, and the crit! 20%. I mean, 20% chance is okay, but I guess it does give me more attack, so that should kill it. And then I've got a 30% chance to crit, which I don't get. Does it have a counter? Oh, do we save Rexy? I don't think Rexy is something that we need to save, though. Am I wrong? Am I making a big mistake here? Might be making a big mistake. Yeah. Okay, okay. What I will do here is I'll swap in the Indominate. Don't you swap out yours, please. Don't do it. I need this health. Oh my god. Okay, so instead of doing 200, we did 3,000. And that should be a lot of health. And then, yeah, even if Dodo comes in, I think it does have its revenge. I don't know what the revenge does. So that's 1,000. Does anything get? Okay, I think I'm going to stay in. Oh, it doesn't matter, does it? Should we just kill it? Just kill it. We got some health. Okay, so we lost Rexy. F's in chat. But we did get some health back on Indonemies. That was a little bit more tough than the other ones, but we're going to hit the 60s now. Ooh, it is a tricky one. I mean, obviously Rexy and Indonemies. Um... Maybe Serato. But uh, something that I can fodder off uh, will put in the frogs. Something that can swap in and it can take a few hits. I don't think, apart from the Alberto on the Revenge, can hit everything. So, what's the worst thing that could happen here? What's the worst that could happen? We'll go for Indian enemies. Indian enemies seem safer. Rexy is more... I don't know. Niche. Oh! Okay. Do you think it's going to swap to Illidominus? Because I just wanted to do a cloak and then a massive heal for myself. So I think it might be Illidominus coming in. Oh, it's Dio! Dio! Oh no! A speed reduction say it's not so! Uh, he is... Oh, he's faster than me by one. Oh. But he's definitely dead. Oh, wait! Oh, yeah. I haven't even done my thing yet. Eh, yeah, I'm not stupid. <laughs> right. Oh. You can't get out of this. You can't even shield. 7,000 damage. Is that double? It must be double. Earl Dominus comes in now. Has a revenge, but I think that's only for a cloak. We get a lot of health back. Yeah, revenge for the cloak. Um, I'll just go for a big hit here. Okay, it's dead. I really wish it hadn't have done any damage to me, though. Because I need this guy. <laughs> if I'd stayed in, I would have gained all the health back again. But I think I've only lost health. Sweet. So, we're going to have the Alberta Servia come in. Oh, it didn't die. Ooh. Hey, at least we get to see uh, Ceratosaurus. Um, but... Uh, Sveratosaur will definitely die here, so I'm gonna- I'm gonna switch in the froggies. Yes, look at them go! We got this. We got this. He's <laughs> crazy. Oh, but you only killed one. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, maybe this isn't so good. Um, oh god. <laughs> I don't know what the speed's on them. Oh, 25? Is that faster than Alberta Servia? I don't know. I can lose my frogs. Okay, Alberta Servia. Are you faster? Of course you are. And you have revenge. Um, oh my god. Uh, will you go for revenge? You don't go for revenge. Okay. Right. Oh god. Like Rexy. How much damage does Rexy do? 4,400. That's not enough. Um... You do have precise revenge, or just precise attack, which will do 3,800. I want to get to the 140. I want to get the 140. Um, 
does it remove? No, it doesn't remove. Okay. Oh, it's a precise revenge that hits everything. Okay. Don't go for precise here, please. Don't do it. Okay. Okay. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Worst case scenario. Still really bad because it could go for its its uh, priority now. 17,000 damage. If only we got the heal on that. We lost even more. And we lost a frog. Okay, Rexy's untouched. Which is great. Okay. A level two. Yay. <laughs> right. Let's see what this one is. Um, oh. Ooh. Interesting. Interesting. Um, yep, yep, yep. Um, Alasaur. We could fodder off Alasaur, I suppose. Um, but actually, I want something that's a flock that can be foddered off, like the Compi. Compi could be foddered off. And then, in case it all goes to heck, we'll use Serato. We just need to win two more. That's it. I'm just keeping Rexy alive because it's got that health missing. It's like, oh, I don't feel safe putting in because something could do 4,000 damage to it. Easy. Um, did any of them swap in and do damage? I feel like the two Ceratopsids might be swap-ins and do does damage, so... If I can just get Indon Emmys, doing the cloak, getting the heals... Right, so you got boosts on you. Um, you have a swap-in stunning strike. And you also have survival instinct. Uh, HP over, ability disabled. But if you're threatened, you increase your armor. Ooh, interesting. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It has something to remove my dodge. <gasps> oh, it didn't do it. But it did. it did gain speed, though. But I have half the speed. So I should be faster. Please be faster. Is it faster? Yes. Okay. It does have something that's priority. Instant crush, which could kill me if it goes through. But maybe not. There was no flocks, was there? Something's dead. Something's dead. Uh, I don't think I don't think whatever's coming in can kill me. Or remove, right? Come on, what's this? Scorpius! Ah, damn! There is, there is, there is some thought to this. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Oh no, just my attack. So I could do a massive like. Oh, okay, there we go. <laughs> That's what we needed. Okay, Diablo comes in a little dibble, so we'll get that damage. I'm gonna do this one. Whoosh. Um, why? I don't know. Just want to do some down. Slow down. Um. Yep, there we go. I'm going to get even more health. I don't think I'm going to get my cloak back. I don't think... I think it's a cooldown of two, isn't it? Oh, God. Okay, more damage, more damage. Here's the Healy. That's really good. Um, At this point, I kind of just want to fodder off one of the compies. <laughs> does he Does he lock me in? Okay, he doesn't. Okay, copy off you go. Off you go. Go, go, copy. <laughs> just die. <laughs> just die. Yep, resilient strike. Ah! I guess it would have would have been too bad. Um, nullify him. Um, I really don't want to get him below half because I don't want to increase his armor anymore. Yeah, nullify that. Greater stunning impact. Does that stun me? No, I'm immune to stun. That is interesting. Uh, right. Um. Stun and swat? No. I've just got to do this. I've got, uh, I think he's below now. Damn it. Okay, so now he's got extra armor. Instant crush. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay, we lost the compi. But he doesn't have his priority. He doesn't have... How much damage does Indian enemies do with that big head? 3,600. Um, or Rexy with a revenge... It's going to have to be a heal with Indonemies. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go with the heal. Going to go with the heal. There it is. Okay. We're, we're losing our little ones. And Styracosaur looks. Never face this thing. Um, instant fierce rampage. Okay, it goes first. Right, shielded heavy strike. Okay, okay. Um, it gets its... It's got two. It's got to dig in. It's got to dig in. Okay. Oh, that's 
That's not, not really what I want, though. Because even if I kill it in one hit with Rexy, it's, I'm not going to get the Healy on it. And I may be in a bad situation. Um, hopefully, he doesn't go for his instant fierce rampage. Okay, don't go for... No, 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 no. Oh, it's digging. That's still bad, though. It's, it's not... It's not the best. <laughs> um, Because he's definitely quicker now. Don't do it. Oh, God. <laughs> Woohoo, a little bit touch and go there. We're okay, we're good. Okay, one more. One more. <sighs> Lost the compi. Compi out of here. Maybe we got health with Indian enemies. I think we did. We're on 3,600 before. And now, for 1,400, or sorry, 100. Amazing if it was. A boss Brachiosaurus. Hmm. Does it hit everything with some of it? Yeah, all opponents, all opponents, all opponents. Okay, so flocks are... No help here. Does anything have any buffs for everybody? Uh, it's. I'll give it a shot. I. Th of course, this is one of those situations where you're not going to do it first time. It's 137,000 health. Um, but I think maybe if you whittled it down enough. Hey, it's like Dominion. Oh, sorry, Fallen Kingdom. Yeah, they all blur into one eventually. <laughs> right. Okay. Um, okay, so he's gonna hit everybody and put a shield on him. Alright, okay, you do you. Just a shield. Uh, uh, I guess a shield for you. Um, you should be faster? It, it's, yeah, I'll go with that. You're faster. Um, we'll go for breaking his shield, getting health back for you. And then just give everybody else health and speed. Confirm. Oh, I didn't realize you could, you had to click confirm. Could you re-jigger things? Oh, that's quite interesting. Okay. So hopefully you're not going to take damage. Rexy gives everybody attack and maybe speed as well? Or is it just Rexy gets speed? No, everything gets speed. Okay. Okay. And here it comes. Shield or group strike. It's not that much. It's not that much. But I think depending on what it does next. Oh, we notify it. That's good. Okay, the bait. Right, it's just for increased attack. Okay, okay. Immune to anything. It's immune to speed reduction. It's immune to attack reduction. But in the Nemis, it gets more attack. And we can just do a huge one here. So invincibility. It's it survived three turns. Minimum, it survived three turns. And then a massive attack. Double increased on attack. And how much health did we get back for that? Five thousand. Oh, 1,900. Okay, okay. Uh, what's it going for? Oh, it's going for the big hit. It's going for... Boom. And that's going to kill Rexy. Bugger. Bugger. Um, it doesn't even matter if I do taunt. That's what I was thinking. If I could do taunt, maybe. <sighs> Nothing I can do. I've just got to... I've just got to go for the... Fierce Rampage. Um... Cloak, it doesn't matter. Cloak's going to do a lot of damage. Uh, it's going to go through Cloak and remove it. Uh, I'm going to do that. And then Rexy, you're just going to have to go for your biggest hit. And then... You're dead. Uh, like, if, if Rexy just had 400 extra health here, then I would have survived that and got so much back. Um, oh, I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose it. I'm gonna lo I think I've lost Rexy. I probably lost Indoraptor. I probably lost... Uh, what's it called? I've lost the other one. It's Indonemies. Indonemies is the one here that I see surviving the longest. Uh, and then a massive hit. Not even a crit! Not even a crit! Oh, you should be able to pay bucks to revive your dinos. Okay, here it comes. Here it comes. It's not even a crit, but it's killed Rexy. No! Damn! Damn! Oh, things are vulnerable now. Oh, okay. Nullify doesn't make a difference here. But then, of course, increased attack. Into Nemi's gets increased attack. Um, you've ju I've just got to time the, the cloaks right so that I do as much damage as I can so that I can heal uh, with the Devour ability. Um, okay, so... Right. 
craft, I guess? Does that give me bypassing armor and dodge? Okay, we'll, we'll do that. I think I cleanse myself of vulnerability. He's gonna kill you either way. We'll just go for that. And we'll go for the cloak. Um, second turn, we lose Rexy. Third turn, we've lost Indoraptor. Fourth turn, we might lose Uteranus or whatever this thing is called again. Uteranus. It's not Uteranus. It's definitely not Uteranus. <laughs> but the Prowling Cloak. Okay. So we cleanse ourselves of our vulnerability here, which is great. Then next turn, um, we just go for a massive devour. That's it. In the enemies is the secret here. So cleanse that. Just do some, just anything. 3,000 though. I mean, what is its armor? What is the Bregus's armor? Oh, zero. Okay. So everything's a little bit slower. As long as he doesn't remove. Yep, there he goes. There goes Indoraptor. Come on, don't, don't remove. Don't remove my cloak, please, next turn. I need this. I need this. Um, I won't be faster, I don't think, though. Nullifying does make a difference. We've done a fair chunk. We've done a fair chunk so far. Okay, I think that just goes through. That's brilliant. Massive hit. And then... <laughs> like, what can I do? And the Nemes, luckily, and the Nemes gets hit first. Which is great for him. Oh. Oh, Brigasaur t like, and you turn, uh, the other one is gone. You two, Toronto, whatever. But we get extra attack here. Uh, we've got our cloak. So we are going to do, normally it's 5,000 damage, but because we've got cloak on, 20,000. Oh, that's what you want. That's what you want. How much health are we going to get from that? Will it, will it count? Or is it going to be a set amount? Devour. 6,000. Okay, we could go for a cloak here just to reduce damage. Um, or we could just break its shield. Because I don't know how long the shield lasts for. Um, shield's four attacks, two turns. Um, I need to save it. I need to save this. Uh, we'll probably just break the shield. We'll break the shield. Can one Indonemis take on? Oh, Brachiosaur boss. I mean, it doesn't matter what damage he does here. There's no point even, like, trying to shield it. Now that I think about it, I'm thinking straight now. And no point shielding it, because we're going to heal anyway. So we get more attack. That's great. If we're slower, it... it I, I'm not bothered. I'm not bothered at all here. Because it means I get extra attack for my next turn. So destroy the shield. 3,800. I think Indonemis... I think Indonemis can do this. Okay. Okay. Um, if I go for cloak, it's removed. I've, I've just got to go for big hit. I've just got to go for big hit, hit, hit here. He's only got one move, I think, that removes cloak, and it's that one. I don't know what the uh, the ratio is for it, but I think I might have enough health to tank this. Yep. And it's... Oh! Okay. There's no cooldown for it. It's Maybe it's a pattern? So if I go for my cloak now, and then... I go for Devour. Maybe we can just repeat a cycle. Like, if he's on a cycle, which he might be, this is it. Got this. Oh, my God. We've lost everything. Everything is dead and decaying on the battlefield. But Indonemi still goes. What a champion. What a legend. Have we got a good music for it? No, that's emotional damage. No, no, we want this one. There we go. Indonemi has got this. Six, Come on, enemies, you got this. Okay, this isn't as climactic as I was hoping. It's kind of taken a while. Come on. Here we go. And... We're going to get even more. There's going to be 20,000 damage coming. I think. I think it's 20,000. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's T-Posen. It's T-Posen. Come on, here we go. Oh, please line up for the climax of this song. This will be amazing. Come on. Here we go. Oh, it left. <laughs> oh, that was good, though. That was good. So we still get 3,000 health. I think we've done this. Yeah. I think we've done this. Hey. 
thing. <laughs> yeah, 100%. Oh, it gets a crit, though. Uh, but we do get 3,000 uh, health back. So we should be good. Oh, I was not... I don't think... It's, it's been a while since I've completed one of these. If I have ever completed one of these. But Indonemi is single-handedly doing it. Very slowly. Very slowly, but it's doing it. And there, there it is. There's the massive. And there is the big damage. Then we go for Cloak. Then we go for Devour. And if is this all the way, we'll skip forward. So I will be right back. Okay, here we go. He's down to 6,000 left. We've just recovered to full health. We're going to go for a big hit here. If we get a crit, I think this has finished it. We got 20% chance. Come on. Come on. Okay, well, we have, we have to do its, its little... I mean, imagine if you saw Braxel do that. It's like, whoa, his head flies off at the end. <laughs> oh, no! Okay, okay, come on. Come on. How much damage do I do? 6,000. Okay, so I need a crit. If this is a crit, he's dead. Oh, no, I couldn't finish him in style. Damn. Okay, okay, then normally what I would do here is go for um, a cloak or something, I think. Yeah, I've got enough health to, to tank this, but wow, you technically don't need any other dinosaur for this. There it is, yes! Success completed! Everything dead, but Endonemi's mission complete! Another 140. I was thinking because it was like 60s and then they would make 200 together. No, can't do that. Congratulations, tour complete. You've reached the end of this tour. Check back soon for a new Isla event. Guess it makes up for not even taking part in the Styracosaurus Lux event, I suppose. <laughs> but now, sword by rarity, we can crash the game once we level this guy up from one to level two. Can we get one more level? Probably 150, right? 150. Oh, it's 100. We're going to be 10 off, aren't we? Or is it 100 each time? Oh, it's 100. E oh, I like that. Okay. And level four. There it is. Unless you've paid or managed to run into it in the wild. That is a point, actually. Um, I think he's probably gone now. Oh, Spinosaur. Spinosaur Gen 2. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, no, I do. Okay, I don't have the max. And Dracovenator is... It's gone, yep. It's, it's, it's went somewhere else. But I do want to check now that we have it unlocked. If I can put it in the... Oh, I can't. You know what? I don't use books for anything. Um, So, because they're, they're so pitiful. Like, using books apart from boosts is, is useless. So now if I put you in... Oh, there it is! Oh, it's right outside. How long are you going to be there for, buddy? Eight minutes. Yeah, I'm not making that. <laughs> but it does work, and it is there. And anyway, guys, that is the whole tour for Diablo Ceratops complete. It's going to be back. Going to be, we'll, we'll probably make a Jurassic World the game video. Maybe maybe today? I don't know. But definitely Jurassic World Live is today. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Oh, bye-bye. <laughs>